Okay, welcome back to Flight Simulator 2020. We're here in the Find the Mad Dog MD-80 again. This time we are in the Northwest Airlines library in Minneapolis. We're going to head down to Greer, which is what I believe I've taken before in this with this airline. It's something I've done in real life a few times. So, ready to go, so let's just turn on the beacons and, well, go. So everything here seems to be good. Ground. If we get those chalks gone by simply turning on the beacon, hopefully. Collision on. Okay, that's that. So we start pump on. System B today. Get ready. Get this ready. AP power available. So let's turn the supply off. APU bleed should be on. Okay, good. Run. So that's good. This is all good. So. Fuel tanks are ready to go. This is all pretty much engine stuff that's ready. So let's call the pushback and get out of here. Let's make sure those chocks are gone first, though. I don't want to have issues with our gear. Those chalks are out of there, so let's call the pushback and get out of here. We're only 30 left today, so... We're just connecting first. Could you please disconnect the jetway from the aircraft? I'm going to push our tail to the right. Ah, interesting. Taking off 30 left, that one's landing on the opposite runway. Okay. We'll deal with it. Request pushback. Ground Dynasty Tree 101 requesting pushback. Use the uh, messed up call sign again. Dynasty I need to change it every single time. I keep forgetting to do that. I'm gonna come push us back. We're gonna get out of here. Very old school. Maybe I'll just throw in some old school effects for good measure on this video. There it is. Let's start the airplane. That's right. We'll start without these set properly. So now let's start the airplane. This in. Crown Dynasty Tree 101 requesting pushback. Oh, we didn't hold it long enough. Steer the aircraft to the right. Dynasty Tree 101, your request has been transmitted to the operator. Okay. It's rough starting this airplane. Let's try the right one. have to hold it long enough. Say, uh, there is no hold down here. Like there would be in real life, you could hold it with two hands because you have more than one hand in real life. Simulator, I have one hand, so I can't really hold it down. There we go. Got the pushback. Dynasty Tree 101 requesting the end of pushback. There we go. Now that engine is up. Dynasty Tree 101 request to end pushback received. Parking brake on. Got a power turn over there. Back to clearance. Taxi IFR. 
Han Dynasty Tree 101 with Oscar ready to taxi IFR. Dynasty Tree 101 taxi to Hold Shooter Runway Tree 0. Let's go. Alpha 2 Alpha Alpha 1. Contact tower on 126.71 ready. Better respond in a bit. I'm holding down the start switch right now. Airbus, I miss Airbus. This didn't have to work, this wouldn't work for Airbus. Didn't have to do all this for Airbus, because it would do it on its own. And throw in the fuel. Taxi to there we go. Short runway tree zero left via taxiway Bravo Alpha two Alpha Alpha one Dynasty tree one zero one. There we go. We've got both engines started up. Turn off the auxiliary hydraulic pump. Wait, just wait for the power turnover first. What happened? Ladies and gentlemen, if I could please have your attention to review some important safety information. In preparation for departure, I'll be certain that your seatbelt is straight up. Your tray table is straight Oh, that was a weird start. Okay. To make sure it stabilizes. Okay, now it's stable. Good. Let's turn the packs back on. Air off with the APU, APU itself. Off. This here, start pump off. System here. Let's see if we can set our flaps to take off. Disagree. Flap disagree. Okay, flaps to take off. That's good. Turn off the auxiliary hydraulic pumps. Do we have hydraulic power? We do. I don't think we get the transfer pump either. We're good. It's a little bit off on the two higher off light control test. Okay, so this is not X-Plane, that doesn't work that way. Let's turn this off and get going. See you guys on the runway. So here we are, ready, all normally ready for takeoff. So, landing lights on. Let's go ahead and get that transponder set to T-A-R-A. W-X-R. I don't think FS-2020 has one actually. Let's set this to reject it. Take off. In case things get weird. But you never know. They might. Position. Turn that to both. Autopilot on. Not yet. Auto throttle armed. Set to take off. I'll press that when we're on the runway. Up here, everything is good. Fire attendant seats for takeoff. Things look good up here. Nothing is out of the ordinary. So let's contact the tower and get clearance to well take off. To the tower. Take off clearance IFR. Minneapolis Tower Dynasty Tree One Zero One at runway Tree Zero left, ready for departure IFR to Greer. Dynasty Tree One Zero One altimeter Tree Zero decimal Two Zero wind calm traffic is generic on final. Cleared for takeoff runway tree, zero left. What'd you say? Cleared for takeoff runway tree, zero left, dynasty tree, one, zero, one.
I didn't set that performance properly by forgetting something. So we need to get going. So they've cleared us take off before that thing comes in. Let's go. Let's have the cool pilot handle communications as well. Uh-oh, my throttle's stuck. Hang on, be right back. Okay, got the throttles unstuck. United 2311, follow the aircraft on the runway. Wind calm caution, the generic landing runway tree zero right. Auto throttle was at control. Let's Clear keep going. Is the aircraft right. on the runway? This is weird. Yes. We just have to ignore it again. Uh, ATC. Let's ignore that plane's existence. My gosh. Ooh. We got an engine failure. Stop. Stop the airplane. We got an engine failure. Ooh, our engine just failed. That's not good. <laughs> Uh, let's get off the runway. United 2 tree, 1 1 go around. Hang on. We got an emergency here, tower. Our engine is. dead. Our right engine just totally failed out. So this flight's not happening then, is it? Alrighty. Let's check and see what happened. First of all, let's shut the engine down. Let's get off. Are we off the runway? Are we safely off the runway? We are. So brakes on. Go ahead and get that engine shut off. Wow, that was unexpected. Good thing we armed the brakes. That engine totally just failed. Can't see. So, how do we um, report to the tower that our engine failed? Don't. So, let's go just take a break. Go taxi. And I'll see you guys on the tarmac on the apron to deal with that engine failure. We get that engine failure checked out. So, I have no idea what happened. We just thought our engine just randomly shut off. Not the only had to start twice either. engine is dead.
going to try restarting it, then maybe we can go. So, get that engine a start, a second start, see if it works. Alright, so start system. That engine is dead, so we just need to repair it. So we've turned the APU power back on. Good. Let's go ahead and shut the other engine down as well. We're not going anywhere today. <laughs> Bring the flaps back in. Whew. Good thing though is we're safe. Get the collision off. Position just to position. Go ahead and turn these flight directors off. We're not going anywhere today. Now with the dead engine we aren't. Dogs back in. They are. Good. No seatbelt sign off. Turn the packs back to auto so they can the passengers can have some air back there while we disembark from the aircraft. With a dead engine. Kelly power back on because why not? Alright. Whew, glad it happened on takeoff though and nothing else. That could have been really bad. Oh, reset. Whoops. That could have been really bad. Aircraft services, maintenance. Open up this engine cowl. Ground. Door stair. Open up the forward main. Forward stair. Aft main. Aft stair. Okay, good. I do not know what happened, but we need to get that engine looked at. It went poof. The passenger's off. Start on board. Oh yes, that's what I meant to do. Turn off that news light. Off. Retract those. Auto throttle should be reset. Maybe I did something there, I don't know. Probably. Anyway, we're safe. We're on the ground. Let's get the engine looked at. And is there a failure in the failure menu there? Hmm. Third opposition components. Nothing. Interesting how that happened. My engine is totally dead. So, okay. Fixed. Everything's fixed. So I'm not sure why the engine just died there. It's very interesting how that happened. Anyways, we'll come back to this. Try again another time. So, everyone's safe though. Anyways, thank you for watching. See you guys next time after we fix the airplane and.
we are again after that um, interesting rejected takeoff there, where I think I caused the engine to uh, poke out. But uh, you know you live to learn. So um, speaking of that, let's go ahead and set this to rejected take. Oh no! Rejected takeoff up here. Get these pneumatic deals going. Okay, so now we've got some uh, pressure. We've got to turn it off immediately though. Start pump. System A, start pump on. Fuel heat, never don't need it, so this is all good. So let's go ahead and get pushed back. Everything is closed. We're good here. Master caution off. Anti collision on. Let's call for a pushback. Hopefully, we have one. Yep, there's one right there. Going to runway 22, which means we push ourselves. 22 is this way, so we push our tails to the right again. So, let's push back with the bad voices. And still the wrong call sign. Here we go. Disengage that parking brake. I'm going to go ahead and start the engine. There it goes, and that jetway is broken for some reason. I don't know why, but it is. We'll have to deal with it. Hopefully we don't get any failures from this bad start procedure. So, I don't have the super pushback. Dynasty Tree 101 requesting pushback tug to steer the aircraft to the right. Dynasty Tree you have to deal with it this way. Has been transmitted to the operator. Taxiing hold short runway 22 by a taxiway Alpha Blue Street. Power turn over. See, it's not going to make it. It's going to push us right in the grass. So pushback stop. Rear ground Dynasty Tree 101 uh, requesting this is the end of annoying. pushback. Dynasty Tree 101 request to end pushback received. Let's pop the other engine. Something, I gotta get something to uh, do a pushback where I can tell it where to go. It just puts me there and I don't have to worry about it. I can, so I can actually focus on things I'm supposed to be focused on while I'm flying the airplane. Alright, let's get this guy going again. If you can see the weather, it's going to be an interesting flight today. Right, good. That one caught it. There we go. So let's pop this back in. Wait for that power turnover to happen. There it goes. So we're on generator buses now. We can shut the APU generators. We can just leave them on. Shut the APU off. Turn the bat on. Okay, so let's send the flap to take off position. Disagree. Take off position. Take off position, good. Let us. 
Arm those. Start pump goes off. We're good there. AP power should not be available, but it is what it is. So, turn the nose light on. Get taxi clearance. This weather is interesting. Early autopilot day. Taxi to and hold short runway 22 using taxiway alpha cross okay. runway 22 alpha okay. dynasty tree 101. Did it again. Either way, that's that. I am not good at this today. So, what they're doing, flight attendant things. I'm going to go ahead and take us to. Look at this ridiculousness. Oh! No, I did do it right. They just give me weird instructions. Alright, so I'm just going to go with the instructions that I have here. So. Get on the runway. On the runway, so let's go ahead and get ready to go. Hopefully this time nothing bad happens. Right. Got to go autopilot very, very early today. Position both. There we go. Transponder. To TARA. So we can begin transponding. The clock will leave it alone. Green Tower. Okay, here we go. Take off clear. It's IFR. Just ignore it. Ignore the bad voices. Asobo! Alright, co pilot, all yours. Asobo, do something about that, please. Okay. So get ready there. Takeoff clamp is set. We should be able to do it properly this time. And we're going to go right into all that mess. Set. Auto brake. Auto brake. Take off thrust. Auto set. Oh, that's way. There we go. 80 knots. Cross check. It's happening. There we go. There we go. That's better. Gotta be very careful with this one. Right, positive rate. You're positive coming up. Rate. Gear up, lights out. Right, thank you. So let's push down a little bit. And I can't see anything, so we're already a thousand feet. So autopilot on, please. I see you guys on cruise.
Okay, and just like that, we've been told to descend um, because this is a short flight, which is okay. So now we are. We'll set it back to cruise because we never met cruise. We went straight to descent, so we'll just go there. That will do that, and we will begin our descent into Atlanta. So let's go initial reference. Some landing performance set up here. LS is 109.30. Let's go ahead and set that right here. 109.30. Alright, awesome. Let's do performance. Looks the weather looks a little bit better here than it was in Greer. For that giant mass of nastiness right there. Do landing. Report Kilo Alpha Tango Lima, runway 8 left. Good. Missions dry, flap 1128, 1540. Winds there are. Delta I'm trusting the autopilot. This is a real flight, by the way. This is something that, uh... Oh, wow. We are above. Need to go down more. Sir? I used to do quite a few times. Go see my family that lived. We'd, uh... We'd want to take the drive. Zero one twelve one two zero point one high pressure. They good. Some southwest west two ten at five. Dynasty tree one zero one contact Atlanta Center on one two eight decimal zero. Good Not day. bad. Outside air temperature is twenty five degrees. Dynasty tree one zero one Atlanta Center continue to KILRR as planned. We have plus five runway eight left auto break manual. Max medium. We'll go water break medium, so that's that. Landing weight is going to be the gross weight now 554, 5000. So, total, so I'd estimate 54,000 or 53. Calculate. Awesome stuff. So let's set the auto brick to medium so we can get that. I'll see you guys on final. 2500. Atlanta Tower, Southwest 27448 miles west inbound ILS runway 8 left approach. And we're going to use. Southwest 2448 Atlanta Tower. Okay. There we go. Got it. Oh. Alphabet equals X Microsoft UPSPH equals. Okay, there we go. Oh. There we go. Now I can see a little bit better. Let's get some speed back. There it is. I can see it. Weather's not good, but I can see Clear to land runway eight left somewhat. Hey, look! How about that? I can hear myself again. Clear of conflict. Okay, good. Very ILS day today. No, it's somewhere in this general direction with where I'm going. Using my ILS, which Delta I have actually tuned this time. Dynasty Tree 
one, number two for landing. Follow the generic on final. Phoneme alphabet equals X Microsoft UPS PH equals WIHND win slash phoneme two one five and eight. Okay. Caution the generic landing runway eight right. Clear to land runway eight left. We got it in sight. Clear to land runway eight left number two dynasty tree one zero one. When we in sight. Delta 1639 turn next taxiway. Southwest 2744 go around. Okay. Delta 1639 contact this ground on 13. Kind of Clear of conflict. Travel. Going around Travel. southwest 274. Not stable Why? approach at all. I'm not gonna go around if it tells me to, because I don't have time in real life. But, yeah. Oh, I can see it. The runway. Clear of conflict. Okay. Climb, climb. I don't care about what the ATC says. It's already been weird today. Which one is eight left? Is it this one or that one? Clear of convoy. Traffic, traffic. Screw it. Three. Okay, there we go. Here it is, this is eight left. There's nobody here though. Long landing. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. All right, down. And stop. Sixty knots. Okay. Dynasty tree one zero one turn next down. taxiway. Hey, that actually went okay, even though it was super unstable. Okay. It actually went okay. Okay, one two one seven five. So let's go ahead and turn the APU back on. That was a bit tough. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, good. So that's that. Let's get the landing lights off. Need this one to dim. It's not that necessary that we see everything. Just position anti-collision stays on. Turn off the... What is it? Transponder. So let's turn the APU air conditioner off as well. So we don't end up dual bleeding the engines. So it's good. That's good. Alright. Oops, forgot to turn the, this all on, so yeah. It is what it is, so that's that. And... Let's see the gates. Atlanta ground, Dynasty Tree 101, taxi to the gate. Dynasty Tree 101, taxi to the gate. Foxtrot, flight one, right attack, point Bravo, one, one, Bravo, Delta, cross, runway two, six, left, Delta. Be a bit of a long taxi, but okay. Taxi to gate, Foxtrot, five, one, using See you guys taxiway, at the Bravo, gate. One, one, Vacation data to detail that this aircraft is that might actually cause problems. I don't think they're going to ask me to hold position anymore because I'm already here. 
no reason for me to hold position anymore. Just want to annoy me. Sometimes I do think this um, ETC is just meant to annoy us, though. In Microsoft Flight Simulator. I just asked you to do stuff that's just not right. And that guy is kind of standing there. An airplane coming towards him. And now he's in the wing. Awesome. Okay, let's get it in. the engines out completely. That'll stop us from moving. My parking brake set. Aircraft service is here. Let's go ahead and stop blinding him by turning this off. Alright. And the APU is on the buses. Turn on that bleed so we can keep the air going in the back. A lot of pressure there. Let's shut down the engines. Starting with hmm, this one, I guess. Power turn over. And this other one here. Power turn over. Bring that all the way up. Okay, so turn this on. Transfer. The auxiliary pumps. Okay, let's get the camera reset. Seatbelt sign off. This is all off. Fuel pumps off. Light directors off. Auto throttles off. Autopilot is off. Anti collision beacon off. Okay, there we go. Now, let's get the jetway to come meet us. Jetway connection. Atlantic Ground Dynasty Tree 101, could you please connect the jetway the to cargo. the aircraft? Okay, forward main is open now. Good. We can begin. Okay, so to aft main, aft stair. Begin unboarding. Open up the cargo doors. Service door as well. There we go. Ground. This is all good. Maintenance. Check the gear doors just in case. That elevation data issue. Still there, see? There. That's where we had our issue. All those are open, we can go ahead and safely turn off the hydraulics. And call out a flight, so transition off. Hydraulic pump, the hydraulic pump off. Go ahead and depressurize those. Alright, there we go.
Total airspeed 130. How? We're not even flying. Okay. Whatever. Maybe that's the last reading from when we... Oh, WX. Off. Okay, good. Right, now get away. Now you can come close. Off. Don't need that there either. Brakes are depressurized. Alrighty. Good. What a day. Cloudy day. And there's other planes here. So, let's go ahead and call it a flight. Second flight ever. Second two or three flights after a mistake. In the uh, flight of Mad Dog X. So, that's that. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys next time, and goodbye.